All right, how you guys doing? Hey, Ryan. Right. Yeah. Yeah. It's a great night, ain't it? Um, I'm kind of new to the Episcopal Church, especially Grace. Uh, it's been really great. Um, I just had no idea when I joined the Episcopal Church that coffee was just another sacrament. <laughs> uh -huh. I mean, we all remember that portion in the book of Matthew where Jesus says, Jesus took the cup and he said, uh, hold on five minutes, coffee's not done. <laughs> you give me a few minutes here. Um, but now I got confirmed two months ago, Casey. We got confirmed. And yeah! It's been great. Um, Casey has a bit of problem with the word Episcopal, though. <laughs> Every time he says it, he sounds like he's peeing on a pill. <laughs> now, I'm not saying that he does that, but I'm just saying if you're getting your Tylenol, I would go to Rite Aid. <laughs> now, I don't know how many of you are into sports. Where's Art? I know he's into sports. He always wearing that shirt. Sure, good, dress. <laughs> but uh, we got the Lions. The preseason's coming up soon. Not a very good idea. I've already got my antidepressants on call, <laughs> so I can deal with that. Um, how many of you into politics? Uh, oh, not very many, I see. Well, I love politics. I mean, you got you got Barack Obama. He's energizing his crowd. John McCain put his crowd to sleep. Uh, you know, it's really good. You got uh, George Bush. He's getting ready to leave office. Yeah. 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 <laughs> I mean, you know, I'm just kind of wondering, though. Most presidents get a library after they leave office. Exactly how many Dr. Seuss books are there? <laughs> I mean, I'm just saying, there's not going to be any books in there with three-syllable words. <laughs> in that library. Um, now, you know, George Bush, you know, he's leaving and everything. A couple months ago, they had him on camera dancing on the White House lawn. No music was playing, though. I guess that counters the Democrat position that nothing's going on inside his head. He's got music in there. And then, I don't know if you guys seen this, uh, but he picked up the Pope from the airport. He was the Pope chauffeur. <laughs> I guess this proves that some people will do anything to get into heaven. <laughs> now, um, like I said, we got John McCain, Barack Obama running. I kind of like them both. You know, John McCain, if he gets elected, I'm sure the price of Bengay will come down. That's some of the of mine. Kind of and if Barack Obama gets elected, I'm sure this bumping will become somehow on cool or something, and well, that won't be any awkward for the little younger friends I have. You know, they do this weird stuff. I'm like, quit it. I'm trying to do, I'm trying to do games. So I'm gonna get beat up around here. Uh, but you know, my younger friends they do that. I prefer to handshake older people. I don't know if it's the arthritis or a lot of moving things make them dizzy, but they do a nice firm handshake. I like that. That bomb. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> uh, my mom's here tonight. Okay. Yay! Yay, mom. Yay! We grew up Pentecostal. Woo! 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 Now, have you ever been inside a Pentecostal church? Oh, yeah. You know, you know how it is. There's always at least one person prophesying, and it always ends with the saint, the Lord. Yes. Oh, now, I'm just kind of wondering, how come God's still stuck in the 16th century? He's still using the King James language. I'm trying to be like, yo, that's what the Lord said, what's up? I mean, that's how it should go now. But I grew up, I grew up in a Pentecostal church, and my mom would be in church. A little different when you go in church and you come back out. So my mom would be in church, she'd be like, Jesus! <laughs> she just be all in. She, Jesus, Jesus. The moment she got in the church, and that was one step off me. I'm gonna kick her. <laughs> but that's all right. That's all right. 
Um, now my mom's got a friend, we call her the belated prophet. <laughs> because she always tells you something that's going to happen after it's already happened. <laughs> She's like, the Lord told me. I'm like, well, the Lord should have told you to tell us. <laughs> but my mom be on the phone with her. Ooh, Jesus. Ooh, the devil been after me. <laughs> now her friend don't curse at all, now mind you, okay? Uh -uh, no cursing at all. Ooh, Jesus. She's like, hold on. She pressed the mute button. Would y'all shut up, idiot? <laughs> when she get back on her, ooh, Jesus. <laughs> so, anyways, thanks very much. Happy <laughs>